Remember when I said I don't think I'm gonna drive the boat? I think I'm gonna drive the boat. We're taking our sweet ass time. We're not gonna fuck this up. I've done this before in a Nancy Drew game in a canoe and I've died many times. So let's not fucking do that. But I do, I really wanna snoop. Let me snoop. Yes. I knew there was something there. I knew it. We got a new postcard! I want to snoop! <gasps> Why are there whales? I got a sticker. I got a sticker. Hi, JR. It's so good to see you. How are you this week? That's why I was obsessed. I missed your streams because I had to stay over to do um, uh, the work for Lucky Tail. I'm so sorry, Mexican Robin. That's so frustrating. I don't I don't like to hear when, when bosses aren't taking into account um, a workload versus a person because that just shows either lack of leadership or their lack of will to get proper resources. So, um... I'm very sorry to hear that. That's very frustrating. I know, it's a really pretty archipelago. Okay, well, clearly we have to snoop everything. Um, so... Come with me! And we'll snoop! Till there's nothing left to ever snooper. Oh my god. Oh lord. Read signposts. You are here. Arthurton's best lake is a fishing area. Shallow grave waterway. Nice. Danger. Low visibility. Skull Island. Okay, so we have to get through this whole fucking thing. Okay, well, we're going to go back. Oh, we're going to go back. I, I, wanted to, I actually wanted to see um, a map because I wasn't sure what the hell was there, but now we're going back. Now we're going back to go say hi to the whales. Hi, Naughty. It's good to see you. How was your week? Didn't like my mom's mash, but the other half seems um, to like how, I, uh, how they make them, even though I wing it every time. There you go. Archipelago. All right, so now we know. We're gonna go say hello to our whale friends. Because that is what you do when a majestic whale is nearest to you. I don't know why I'm singing so fucking much. And that's a very good singer. Oh, my Lanta. We're gonna go say hi. We're gonna take our time. We're gonna snoop and not bang up Susie's boat. Because we're good cousins and I'm teaching Jenny LeClue manners. She's being a bit of a brat and only child and you can definitely tell, but she's also probably gone through a significant amount of trauma. Investigate area. I swim in the shadows of giants. Oh. <gasps> This must be the place. <laughs> sandwich shop? What are we getting from a sandwich shop? Hole? Whoa, that was huge. I have to get a closer look. How close? Ooh. Oh. Oh. Am 
I pissing things off? I'm very confused as to what I'm doing. So I'm just gonna hit buttons. Am I searching them when they're in? Oh, hell yeah. I want that. I want that. I want that. The elusive red herring. A rare and fantastic sight. We're back at the red herring. We're back at the red herring. I can't believe they really exist. I want that. Give it to me. Someone who's definitely qualified to critique someone else's uh, singing or singing is fine. Oh, thank you. Jenny had always believed they were a fisherman's tale. But seeing them first half. She's so beautiful. But what was stuck in her scale? Yeah, we need to take that out because you know, human human stuff should not be in animal stuff. I missed it. I'll do better. Oh, yeah, baby. Pick up bottle. A in a bottle. Curious. Ascend an SOS to the world. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I hope that I someone gets my. I hope that someone gets my. I hope that someone gets my. Okay. I am the voice. Of reason. I walk amongst the sunken ships. Oh my! Hi, sprinkles. That one sailed through the glowing mist. Oh, it's another clue. It is another clue. This case just got more dangerous. Yeah, no shit. Jenny had no idea who was behind these messages. Which this is why we have to find out. Or it could be the answer I need to prove my mom's innocence. Maybe the red herring was my favorite item to get in the Monkey Island series. Ain't that the truth? Head for the light, whales. Head for the light. Followed uh, closely by the rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. The best course of action was to go back and get help from an adult. No. No. I have to see where this leads. On my own. Let's do this, Nancy Drew style, baby. We don't even have a nerdy ass boyfriend that we have to call. We don't even have a set of best friends. Well, we do have a set of best friends. Sunken ships, glowing mist. That should be easy to spot. Sunken ships, blowing miss. Thanks, fishies. Thanks. They're not fishies, they're mammals, but it's okay. All right, let's make sure there's nothing over here. I don't think so. All right. So I guess we're going to be doing a full thing in this level, which is delightful. Okay, so. I'm going to be very careful because this is a rich person's boat and they can sue me. Okay. I hope you like my sea shanties. That music got very intense. Okay. All right, so let's look up and then we will go down. Wait, can I take this? Of course I can't. Stop it. Stop it. We will go up and then we will go down. It's a secret beach. Explore, beautiful. Arthurton! What are these buoys supposed to be doing? They're not doing a very good job. Okay, time to go through this area. All I know is that we're not supposed to hit them or anything else in this area. That is the most I have garnered. 
from this mechanism so far. I like this, like, pseudo-EDM music. There we go. Let's do this. But, uh, we have, uh, but we, uh, know have a nerdy popular friend that's a girl we can call. It's true, we don't. It's true, we don't. Forgot how to accelerate the boat. A sticker. Like a crabby rock. Make sure there's nothing over here. Alright, I think we're looking good. Danger, low visibility. I mean, I mean, I can't see a thing. I must be heading in the right direction. Obviously. We're going to go very slow. I got a sandwich in the vlog. Oh, how great is that? This is definitely a ship. This is definitely a ship. There might have been a couple of ships, but that's just me. I will investigate the area. Ooh. Ooh, look at the scary flag. Ooh. Ooh. Everything okay? Thank you for that sandwich. Jenny navigated carefully through the thick fog. Yes, we did. Oh, it smells like rotten fish. Many ships Great. have lost their bearings here. Grounded on the ragged rocks, swallowed by the lake. Swallow! Maybe I could shed some light on these ghost ships. Badooch. Are we, uh, are we referencing some, uh, this should be a little scary, not gonna lie, don't like those noises, not the biggest fan. Trying to leave them all illuminated. Let's try that first. Hey, what's this? Yeah! Give me another message in a bottle. Let's do this. Another message? Yep. This yep. is starting yep. to feel like a wild goose chase. Well, I mean, most mysteries are. I am the hope in darkness. I sit in a spiral of ancient stone. Against the clock, I move alone. What's with all these cryptic messages? And where They're are they leading? They're all riddle. I should get out of here before I turn into a ghost. 
I mean... Time to go, baby. This is cool. I like this one, so. The message just says, send more bottles. <laughs> I mean, inevitably, we will be. We're driving very slowly. We're being responsible. Also, it's never a good look when there's planes in a lake. I'm just saying. It's not like super Phew. ideal. Made it out alive. Let's go find this spiral of ancient stone. Well, it's probably gonna be where the lighthouse is. I'm guessing it's gonna be called Rock Round. Also, I like how it says Skull Island Lighthouse and Sandwich Shop. All right, here we go. Time to go to the rock round. And take a look at Skull Island because it looks so fucking cool. Anything over here? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Look at this fucking Skull Island. Is this also called Tortuga? Are we gonna hang Skull out Island, with the pirates? An abandoned lighthouse. And an excellent sandwich shop. Ooh! Abandoned? Abandoned lighthouse? And how is it still on? That seems fishy. That seems hella fishy to me. Also, we are so fucking zoomed out, I can't tell where anything is. That's why we ran to the damn buoy. Also, that was the first time I ran into anything, so I'm pretty proud of that. We definitely want to go up to this round thing. This takes a decent amount of con uh, concentration, but it's so cool. But also, don't go on a boat at night. Don't do that. Don't do that. It's kind of dangerous. In rocky waters, I should say. Decommissioned over a hundred years ago. But the light mysteriously continued to illuminate the darkness. I didn't realize that he was still talking. Sorry. Didn't realize he was still talking. Investigate area. Give me another bottle. If Sting pops out of this one, I'll be pretty happy about that. The night grew dark and eerie. Why do I feel like I'm being watched? Because you are. Ah! Remember when I said the birds work for the bourgeoisie? Creepy. Seems to be in pretty good working order for being abandoned. Mm-hmm, my thoughts exactly. Well, aren't you ominous? A little bit. Nice birdie. What are you doing all the way out here? How rude. Bird, bird, bird. Bird is the word. Well, clearly, I think we're scaring this bird. Seem to like that. Watch it, buddy. Talk about a murder of crows. Hey. It threw a rock at me. 
a weird fucking rock, though. Ew. That was not a rock. That was not a rock. That was not a rock. Oh no, did Zoro not like the crow? I beg pardon? Oh boy, those are creepy. Who needs lizard people when you have crab people for this conspiracy theory? Hey, hey, hey. Shit balls. Pick up the bottle. <laughs> tap it open. Tap, tap it open. I am the answer to the unasked question. I stand inside the crescent moon. Below death's gaze, I wait for you. My goodness. Sorgatani, please I enjoy your lurk. You. Bird, bird, bird. Bird is the word. Sting lives in a bottle. He must have a ton. You must save a ton on rent. <laughs> crab people. Crab people look like crab talk like people. Mm -hmm. This could be the last clue. Could it be the last clue? So caught up in unraveling the mystery, Jenny failed to recognize how dangerous this chase really was. Who is waiting at the crescent moon? Let's do it. Whoever it was, our intrepid detective would need to be extremely careful. It's gotta be CJ. It's gotta be CJ. My dinner, that is. Was it super gooey and fantastic and everything that you moon. needed in this exact Below moment? Case. Time to wrap up this case. Time to wrap up this case and collect all of our postcard pieces. Here we go. All right. We are done with this one. Time to go down to the other side of Skull Island. Should obviously continue this way because I'm sure that there is something creepy that we should go take a look at. Random acceleration was not appreciated. Probably should have taken a look at the map. Crap. Man, I want to buy Avengers, but new consoles are a couple months away, so I feel silly. Uh, to buy uh, new games on a current gen. I kind of feel that French llama. Hi, Silver Grey Ninja. It's so good to see you. How are you? It's been a hot minute. I hope you're doing super duper well. Thanks for joining us for some indie goodness. Uh, this actually looks like the place we were supposed to go. So. It's like a nice little crescent island but underneath death's gaze <laughs> well you know me busy as always how about you i mean pretty pretty solid pretty solid uh when it comes to that for sure i also feel that way but i hope it's good busy and not like super stressed out icky busy oh Damn it, did I have another fucking Mario moment? Oh, God bless it. They're gonna ask me to start doing his voices soon. Shit. Hello? My big oh, who's there? St stay right there.
right there. Don't come any closer. Hello. Identify yourself. It's a statue, darling. It's a statue, darling. Whoever you are, the police are right behind me. I said persuade, not bluff like we're peeing our pants. And they're very angry. Wow! That one? I was hearing more about how they were handling DLC microtransactions or something like that. Oh. Oh my gosh. And JR, how are you doing, darling? I hope you're doing well. Whenever I'm, I'm whenever I'm but lurking in help you if you just Lily or uh, Little Reds, I definitely see you around. But I haven't been very talkative lately, so they're probably going to roll characters out over time. That would make sense. It's a statue, Jenny. It's okay. Okay, if you won't cooperate, I'll I'll have to come over there. Shine that light right in their face. Just go. There you go. That's what I wanted. That's not what I expected. Oh, it was just my imagination. Thank God. The dogs might let us before the dog. Do you remember when I said it's probably CJ? Do you remember what I said that it's probably CJ? God fucking damn it, CJ. God. I get any more of those, my ass is gonna be in my chest. Ah! Get away from me, you maniacal murderer! He's fine. CJ is a master ninja, honestly feels like it. The dogs bark loudest before the dawn. Is he in a scuba set and does he have goddamn floaties on his on his wing on his arms right now? CJ? Yes, of course it's the CJ. The dogs bark loudest before the dawn. Also known as um, Peter Capaldi. The early bird can't catch the lazy worm. The wind blows strongly from the east. People in glass houses should invest in curtains. I think I have to remember what I said the first time to him, and that's what I said, so. The sky is full of fireflies. The last donut is the tastiest. Excellent. Jen. They haven't broken you yet. Oh my god. The notes were from you? I thought of you were the Of course killer. they are. It's not actually Peter Capaldi, but it is Peter Capaldi slash Doc Brown. Like that is like that is the character. That is who they are. Why did you make me go through all that if you were already in the boat? This is the only place safe from their prying ears. It sounds like Peter Capaldi. Have to hurry. This line isn't secure. Line? We're talking in person. Exactly. Now quickly, before they get a fix on our location. What did you want to tell me? Seriously? You can't keep doing this. You contacted me. Did I? Actually, I'm glad you did. I need to ask you a few questions about the Dean's death. Questions! Good, Jenny. Question everything. Trust no one. Thank you. The interrogation of CJ. What are our... <gasps> it's pointing to something. It's actually pointing to something. What happened to your compass? Before it was wandering, but now it seems to be pointing in one direction. Exactly. Do you it see does sound like Chris Lloyd. It's not a compass at all. So what is it then? The magnetic Aliens! needle? Aliens! Oh, honey, no. Aliens? What are you talking about? E.T. Extraterrestrials. Beings from another world. I know what aliens are. Come on, CJ. There's no such thing. What? No. Not you too. I'm sorry, CJ, but it's time to get serious. The Dean is dead and my mom's in jail, framed for a murder she didn't commit. I need to get to the truth. The only way to truly see is to open your mind. Not everything is what it seems. Of course. If there really are aliens in Arthurton, how come you're the only person who's ever seen them? Because he is an alien. People don't see what they aren't looking for. That's why I come here every night, to observe the unobservable. The compass is my eyes. 
It can sense their presence where I cannot. Why don't you borrow it and find out for yourself? I will take the compass. Okay, I'll take it. I need all the help I can get. Good. You can prove my theory to be fact. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Just remember, we gotta come when the needle is steady, the phenomena are near. Sure. What if it's they going absolutely before, haywire and bananas? Will return, and we'll be waiting for them. Uh-huh. Yep. Totally. <laughs> she is a sassy ass motherfucker. What do you have stuck in your floaty wings, my dear sir? Gumboat library card. In your floaty wings? I know you're in the library the day Dean Strasbury died. Both, Akusan. Both. I would like to find a mystery in everything that I steal. Did you notice anything unusual? Yes, I did. Who? Me? Great. What happened? They changed the bathroom scent from strawberry to pie. Ooh. Why would you have a bathroom scent that was strawberry? That's disgusting. It was most unpleasant. Nobody wants to shit and smell strawberries. Oh, is that all? I intended to alert the librarian as a matter of urgency. But no one was at the front desk. Of course they were. Quite unusual. Was there anyone else in the library? No, uh, just the dean and I. Till I, uh, I, uh... Until you left. It's not like you to leave your research lying around. Why were you in such a hurry? Better than boiled eggs, well, that's true. Speak for yourself, Yebs. I love strawberries. In a bathroom, though? In a bathroom, though? That's kind of weird. I, uh, I lost track of time. I was late for an appointment. Mm -hmm. An appointment? Where? Appointment? What are you talking about? But pine? Yeah. You said you were I guess there's not really, like, a good bathroom smell, other than clean. Objection. Leading the witness. This isn't a trial, CJ. It's just me, Jenny. Then I have nothing further to say, Your Honor. Lemon is okay. It implies clean. That's true. Citrus is good. Hmm. There's something you're not telling me. Is no that? shit. Guess we have to find it out. Police line, do not cross. I got a sticker. I got a sticker. I got a sticker. I got a sticker. All right. Well, this is obviously a clue. Ooh, and we got another sticker. Ah, oh, fucking za, baby. Wait, I can't investigate the clues, the bottles. All right. Anything on their hands? Yes. Familiar note. Those pine poop. <laughs> I have raspberry potpourri in my bathroom. Oh. Hmm. I don't know. That just uh, maybe. I guess maybe most fruits are okay. I don't know. I've never. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. My busy is kind of a mix of both. Was lurking. No, no, no. Lurk away, Silver Granger. Definitely do that. I found your map just checking in. in. Keep it. It's a great map. Very rare. Very rare. Ripped it straight out of the town charter. First edition. Come to think of it, only edition. What about all your notes? Don't you need them? Nope. Got it all backed up in the cloud. He's going to point to his head. What cloud? His head. Did I say cloud? I meant head. Yeah. Thank you. That's, that's, I knew where that was going. Even after a few years. Oh, good job, Ikea. So what do all those notes mean? Oh yeah, Shadowman. I want to know about Shadowman. Who are the Shadowmen? Yes, you're starting to see differently. There are patterns everywhere. Keep searching. Patterns, patterns, patterns. All right, what am I looking for? What is our last? Does he have a black eye. It's what very subtle. It's very kind of subtle. Fight? I did hear that they were getting rid of Twitch sings. I'm sure that it had to do with music well, and rights and all that other crap. So, it wasn't a fight more of a, a seriously purple misunderstanding. Ah. Well, 
You should see the other guy. No. Uh, isn't the other guy dead? Isn't that isn't that what we're we are referencing right now? Is that the other person is going to be dead? CJ, this is serious. You have to tell me the truth. I had to do it, Jenny. I needed to learn. Oh, it definitely had to do with um, DMCA. No question about it. Yeah. CJ, is this a confession? Well, we're going to find out anyway. CJ, did you murder Dean Strasbury? The Dean? Oh, no. But you just said... Good, Jenny. Suspect everyone. Even me. I don't understand. In fact, I suspected myself for quite some time. But I couldn't have done it. I want to believe you, CJ, but do you have an alibi? That's why I left these notes for you. If anyone can prove I'm innocent, it's you, Jenny LeClue. Hang on a second. Let me take a look at that. Jenny, I need your help. You know, we could have saved a lot of time if you'd just given me this message first. God damn it! Risk being followed? Never! But what had piqued Jenny's interest was not the message itself. What was on? That paper. What did he write all these messages on? Mm-hmm. Yeah, buddy. Oh, shoot. I didn't actually want to do that. There we go. Is it this way? Um... Oops, I spun it too much. There we go. I knew it. This background music sounds uh, like a slowed down version of Ghosts and Goblins. It's adorable. I also definitely pre ordered Super Mario 3D All Stars and the uh, Mario 3D World port to Switch. I'm not ashamed. I'm definitely going to be picking that up. I have, um, I have a GameCube, so I do have Super Mario Sunshine, but it has been a hot minute since I played Super Mario 64. And also, I've never played Super Mario Galaxy. And I have been really wanting to play that. Local idiot ruins school play. Parents feared for children's safety and grades. Oh, so that's when he got... That's when he got a black eye. I've never... I never played Galaxy. It's a bit rough that they are changing... That they are charging $60 considering they aren't even remakes, just re-releases. Yeah. This photo was taken in Avocado Heights. That's on the other side of town, miles from the library. CJ was always protesting something. Always. The first time they had met, CJ had handcuffed himself to a bike rack outside Agatha Krusty's bakery. Never played 64 Sunshine or Galaxy 1 or 2. I personally like 64 and Galaxy. Yeah. He was convinced they were hiding something in the pies. He'd lost the key to his handcuffs, so I picked the lock for him. <laughs> They've been friends ever since. That's adorable. What time is it? What time did they... 3.55. Clearly the afternoon. And he died right at 3.57. Jenny couldn't help it. I never cared for 64. I grew up with Sunshine. Nice! So I never played Sunshine, never had a GameCube. There you go. I only had an SNES. I really like Super Mario Sunshine. I Every time she wish I had more coffee, patience she to play that with you guys. Face. She heard his voice. She remembered his sadness. Aww. And she promised not to rest until she'd uncovered the truth of his father's death. The front page was missing, but even this small snippet worried Jenny. They've been peddling lies about my mom right from the start. No shit. Sheriff Winston the Clue has distanced himself from all proceedings. Well, if he won't help her, I will. Yeah, Jenny. Hold on. I just popped up my stuff. Patience is a virtue. Yeah. I think I just need to practice. I think I need to practice on the game. And then maybe I can run it a little bit um, faster with you guys. 
Um, I felt that way with like Banjo Kazooie, and I probably would feel that way about Donkey Kong 64 too. Um, so I actually do have a Donkey Kong 64 um, save that's right um, when I'm at K Rules lab. I actually have that like all queued up and like ready to go. From who knows when. I saw them. We're looking for one more clue. That's the day Thursday. the Dean's murdered. CJ couldn't have killed the Dean. Nope, there's Cody too many things pointing right to it. Yep. So we eliminated CJ. How can I prove CJ is innocent? Well, we definitely have the clock. He was in Avocado Heights, and it's the same day as the Dean's murder. So the clock was at 3.55, the Dean died at 3.57 on that Thursday, and CJ was all the way over in Avocado Heights. He was nowhere near the library. Black guy doesn't mean anything. Bada bing, bada boom, boom, boom. CJ was photographed in Avocado Heights at 3.55 p.m. on Thursday. Never had 64, only had um, every other console since game. Two nice. minutes before the Dean died. There's no way CJ could have killed him. No way. CJ, you're innocent! What a relief! <laughs> but you really should <laughs> like be going he doesn't even know. terrorizing children. Yeah, seriously. You're going to end up in jail again. Yeah. That wouldn't be so bad. They have the best beds in town. Every part of my being is telling me that my mom is being framed. Yep. I don't understand why. I don't understand why either. We there still need to investigate. There are reasons a man is murdered. He didn't mind his own business. He couldn't keep his mouth shut. <gasps> or he wouldn't keep his hands to himself. Oh, that was really insightful. I liked all of that. Have you ever heard of a place called Widow's Drop? I think my mom met the dean there. Widow's Drop. No, I sound suspicious. Well, anything sounds suspicious if you say it like that. Be careful, Jenny. They'll do anything to keep their secrets. Will they? Once you start to see things, there's no going back. I got my 64 right here. Are there any 64 games that you guys would like to see that you've never seen? Re regardless of, like, if I own it or not? Imagine having to commit a crime in order to have a comfortable bed. Huh, it's almost like... Our, since our mental health system fails, it's almost like most people have to resort to that in order to have shelter, especially when it gets cold out. Superman 64! <laughs> Do you ever wonder why the lake glows at night? Or why the power keeps going out all over town? We have to know. Yes, I do. All the time. There's a lot more to this town if you look below the surface. Do you mean that literally or figuratively? Figuratively. Yes. The truth is hiding right under our feet if we <laughs> only stop to look. <sighs> I'm more confused than when we started. I'm not. Well, I really have to get to my house. This case won't solve itself. It will not. I can drop you off at the bridge. Probably Kirby 64 or Buck Bumble? Mm. No need. I'm staying here. I've never played either of those. Some of these rocks have moved. Never trust a crab with a man's job. What? He's bananas. Be careful, Jenny. They are everywhere. Always watching. Don't worry about me, CJ. They'll never see me coming. I sneak in silence. I creep in the shadows. My footsteps are whispers. She's so dramatic. GG. Damn it! I got this. Don't worry. Damn it! Are you trying to ruin the paint job? Oh, honey. That'll buff out. Sure. So much for being stealthy. Comedic timing. Jenny headed east towards the almost done bridge. I can dock there and make my way through the forgotten forest without anyone seeing me. Let's do this. Sneaky. Sneaky. 
All right, let's do a circle around here to make sure we're not missing anything. There's definitely a piece of the postcard down here on the other side of this crescent moon. I know. You have to protect those paint jobs for a reason. It's not just there for shits and giggles. Oh my gracious. What's Buck Bumble about? Never heard of that. Obviously I've heard of Kirby 64, but I've actually never played it. I don't think I've ever actually played a Kirby game. Now that I think about it. I don't think I've ever actually played a Kirby game. Like Eva in my life. I don't think I have. I don't think I've played that. I've, that, that was a franchise I never really got into. Sounds like something someone uh, in the 1% would say. <laughs> oh, stop it. Let's read the signpost. Okay, so we're going to go up and then we're going to go down. Kirby Star Allies is adorable. Oh, all I know about Buck Bumble is uh, that DS Koopa's community made Super Shiggy sing it after a raid. It's a bee shooting game. What? Uh, oh my god. The theme song is ridiculous. I still have a bunch of my Game Boy uh, ones just saying. Oh, you know what? I think that's why I never. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know why I never got that. That can't be good for the boat. Okay, will you stop? We're doing just fine until you did something. You butthead. I got a new sticker. I do have a way to play them now. That's true. I do, I do. Oh my gracious. Oh my goodness. You're gonna make me go all the way up that little fucking cavern, aren't you? You little shit stain. All right, fine, we'll do this. All right, we'll do this. All right. Only everyone was distracting her by saying, but. <laughs> That's funny. We have all the pieces. Hmm. I hope we're not missing a piece. Postcards. I have four out of seven. I don't think I'm going to be able to get enough of that. Protector. It seems about right. Oh, I didn't read the description. Hang on. Loyal, reliable, and duty bound, you go above and beyond expectations and put others' needs before you own before your own. You are thoughtful and careful, but sometimes take too much uh take on too much and repress your feelings. Okay. That's the second time this game has read me, and I don't appreciate that. I, I still feel like the CEO is a little more apt for that. Um, but also, wow. Wow. Okay. That's fine. Bear claw binge. 
We're not there yet. Dang it, absolutely nothing. Fine. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. No more boats. Goodbye, boats. I like it's hard to figure you out. Listen. That was fun. That was fun. A CJ is a complete maroon, but I appreciate that. Bum, 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 bum. Very ominous red light. The night was still and quiet on the far side of the lake. No one ever comes down here. Not since they stopped repairing the bridge. Why is the bridge out? And yet it was hard to shake the feeling of being watched. Why is the bridge? This is weird. This is CJ's fault. He really believes all that stuff. Once you start to see things, there's no going back. I wonder what he meant by that. I mean, once you start to notice things, it is very hard to avoid it. Hi, C1. It's good to see you. Going on a trip. I know. I need to know what happened to it, too. Aw, cute little birdie. Forgotten Forest Trail. Voted most likely place to be eaten by bears. Arthur Sweet. Gazette. Sweet. Let's do it. I want to get eaten by a big black bear. Because they're cute. Okay. Perfect. Just as I'm about to enter the spooky woods. The good folks at Arthurton Power and Light were not easing Jenny's fear of the dark. Of course, this was the very reason curfew had been put in place. Don't lecture me now, sir. Arthur Finkelton. Keep your lectures and your stream of consciousness elsewhere. Jerk face. See, the power just came back on. We'll be fine. Squishy, I hope that you have a relaxing weekend. Are you at least off uh, also on Monday? I hope. Oh, wait. You're off all next week, aren't you? Oh, absolutely, Squishy. We care about you. You're allowed. Vent away. I'm not going to say we like to hear that because we don't like to hear you having troubles, but we don't mind it. You're off now until the 14th. Hell fucking yes. Jenny's imagination ran wild. In the darkness, every sound was a threat. Every shadow a monster. That's why we're gonna run. But she was nearly home, just a little further. This is such a pretty game. Can we talk about this? Damn bourgeoisie crows again. Have a good weekend, Squishy. Hey. Getting some night in the woods vibes, and I don't mind it. Oh, for fuck's sake. What happened to the bridge? It looked like Jenny had reached a dead end. Boo. She had no choice but to return to Susie's house. Not gonna a happen. Comforting mug of hot chocolate. Not gonna happen. I'd rather plummet to my death. Fair. Can we go back to this? Yes. I got a cute little fun guy sticker. So can I walk on this bridge at all? I guess I can. It was a terrifying drop to the rocks below. Ooh, yeah, that looks... Surely she wasn't shaky. contemplating jumping across. 
Why the fuck not? Are you Mom saying that I can't? Says a great detective takes calculated risks. So let's do the math. Calculated. Six feet. Badly damaged. The bridge is too weak for a running jump. Taking into account the strong tailwind and factoring in my athletic prowess, or lack thereof, <laughs> I could make that jump two out of three times. Not bad odds. Terrible odds. It's pretty shitty odds. Well, here goes nothing. Uh-oh. How we doing? How we doing, okay. Jenny? Maybe the odds weren't so good. No, they weren't. And now she was dangling from a splintered plank one slip away from certain death. It's just like climbing a tree. Just don't look down. Don't look down. Okay. Like how she doesn't have ankles, but she has like biceps of steel. Good, we're going, we're going where it's darker below us. I will hang in there. Gosh darn it. Oh, this looks like the wrong way. Uh, it looks like a way. I don't know if it's the wrong way though. Let's see what we got. Built this. Who built this? Trick, I'm looking down. Ow. Not sure if that was worth it. But we did it anyway. <laughs> oh my gracious. Oh, I can't quite find a comfortable spot today. Going on a trip. Climbing all the way down. Oh shit, did I just go in a, one gigantic circle? What the fuck? Okay. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Maybe I go up there first. Sorry, apparently I have to do this again. We snooped a little too hard. We snooped a little too hard. We shall figure it out though. Ooh, uh, ooh, uh. We're going on a trip. Over here. Yeah, what's over here? Was this the end for our time? As her spindly muscles began You'll to be fine. Away, an image flashed before Jenny's eyes. Her mother, dangling from a ledge, unable to pull herself to safety. How could she possibly save her family when she couldn't even save herself? I can't give up that now. That was deep. Mom needs me. Get up there like your life depended on it. Jenny had barely survived. Whew. Was she really prepared for the dangers that lay ahead? It's too late to turn back now. I mean, there's no way we can climb back up, so let's go. How do you feel? Uh, how, uh, how do you feel if the rules were reversed? I mean, I can hang real well, but I don't know if I can pull myself up. 
Oops, I didn't mean to hit that. Time to run up the hill. It might have been her recent brush with death, but Jenny's heart was pounding in her chest. No, the ring's going that's cray cray. Heart. That's CJ's oh, compass. Compass. The needle is shaking like crazy. Oh, you know what? I didn't think I know why my back. Yeah, that's why. I leaned it back for that meeting. <gasps> now I found the spot. Obviously, we have to look at the hole in the tree. Kick the damaged tree. I wanted to look in the hole. I didn't want to kick a tree. Doesn't seem very nice. Oh, wait. Still going this way? Is this what the compass was pointing to? Jenny paused for a moment and listened. It's a glowing rock? It was quiet, but distinct. A constant pulse. Mechanical. Unnatural. Man-made? But other than the sound it emitted, this rock was like any other in the forest. Hmm. That, what's that, what's that? What's this? Another postcard piece. Curious. Hey, baby. You're telling me there's absolutely nothing else to do this here. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. See, it wants me to keep going there. Do I have enough of the postcard pieces yet? No, I need one more piece. Hmm. Not sure what else I'm supposed to do there. I'm supposed to do there. This is some strong ass ivy, I gotta say. Oop. Yay, we're on the other side. Well, now we know we can get there at least. Really making me run and jump on a lot of things. It's a hell of a mysterious forest, I gotta say. at it. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What the fuck? Jenny had spent her whole childhood exploring the woods behind her house. But I've never seen this before. 
Then she remembered CJ's work. People don't see things they aren't looking for. Ooh. She knocked on the rusty metal. Hollow, it's a trap door. Hey. Hold on. We need to get this first. Thanks. What a pretty bird. It's rusted up pretty badly. I can't move it. What else we got? What a strange device. <gasps> the wires are connected to the door. Anonymous, thank you so much for the 444 bits. Uh, and and spooping me just right. I appreciate that. Oh, shit. Oh, my goodness. Let's do this. Hit that A button. I like this more than I like the magical rock. I mean, fuck going to our house, I guess. Ooh, that's ominous. A stale metallic odor filled the air as Jenny peered into the opening. It sure is dark down there. Too dark. But I can't just leave this unexplored. I have to see where it leads. And so Jenny descended blindly into the unknown. 